Hello, 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 and welcome to Hades 2 Early Access. We are now officially out of the technical test and ready to get going into Early Access, and I cannot tell you how excited I am. So let's get into it. Few tales are told of Hades, whose reign as grim lord of the dead came to a sudden end when all at once his past caught up with him. But gods do not go quietly, and history repeats. So this tale was only a matter of time. Death to Kronos. Death to Kronos. All right, had to remap everything there, but welcome to Hades 2. This game, fantastic. If you haven't played it, you're missing out. It's not really your fault though. Not a lot of people got access, but everyone does. As long as you're on PC, you have access to this, but we are going to start a run. I'm probably going to lose because I always lose my first run. It's the nature of it. Maybe I'll get lucky though. I I did Lost win souls. multiple times Oops. The Titan pay. in the, um, the early access, so it's not impossible. I forgot all the buttons though. So in this game, you have a lot of different options. So you have your base attack, you have your special, and you have your cast. Each of those have a hex option, not a hex option, an omega option, where you can charge them up using your mana. The mana is in the bottom left of the screen here. Like most roguelikes, you are limited to how much you bring into an area. I don't have enough for that one. There are things you can do later on though that upgrade your amount of mana or your region, uh, and that's things like god boons. So let's go check out Apollo. Just a spell, it's just another spell. 10 words. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. I'll never get tired of that. Greetings from Olympus and well met there, Sunshine. Look, we can't get to the Titan, but if you truly mean to stop him, then the least I can do is light your way down. I love him. So all of these are ones that I've seen already. So Nova Strike makes your attacks deal more damage in a larger area. It's very nice. Your sprint, think of it kind of like your dash in Hades 1. Mm -hmm. It makes you go faster and it inflicts days, which basically means they have a 20% chance not to hit you. It's very nice. Kind of like, it's kind of like a spin on Athena's boons. And then while standing in your cast, gradually restore magic. All these are really good. I'm going to go with Nova Strike. Need my aid. Just because it's a nice base one. Be I hate these guys. These guys, the worst. They're not the worst. Many chariots were the worst. I think I switched which keybind my dash was on. That's gonna mess me up. Those both will die. I gotta switch my dash back to the other one. Or just get used to it. I had it on R1 before. It's on R2 now. That's just gonna take me a second to get. So another thing in this game is that you can view your inventory at the all times, which is very nice. I'm gonna go ashes because those are really helpful for meta progression. Something we learned in the technical test pretty early. I'm gonna gather this because no reasons not to, I guess. Kill both of those. I think I can kill those from afar. As you can see as well, they do have armor just like they did in Hades 1. So if they have that yellow bar above their head, they have armor. It's going to be harder to stagger them. Um, you have to break that to get past that. Like Hades 2, or like Hades 1, there are things you can do once you get past, you know, the first area for your first run. You don't have to win, but you can unlock meta progressions, making each run easier. Let's go with maybe some more health here. Go get a centaur heart. I'm dying to know what they added, though. Like, what all gods are unlocked. Oh, shoot. Ah! <laughs> focus matcha. Focus matcha. Yeah, I don't... Oh, I did actually do the Omega on that. Okay, I don't actually have... Oh, the, I just stood in that. That was unfortunate. Like I said, I'll probably lose my first one. It's been about two weeks since I last played this game, so a little rusty. But that was good health right there. We have 77 gold. I don't know if that's enough to go visit Charon. I'm thinking it's probably not. So let's go up here. I'm curious what the icon in the top left is. I haven't seen that one before. So many whalers, get out of here. Everyone go in the circle. 
The whalers are just tough because they have such a big area of effect and they move pretty dang fast, honestly. But we'll get the hang of it as we always do. This game is gorgeous, so. Karen Corb did all the music yet again. Okay, do I go? I'm nervous that if I go for the mini boss here, that I die. If I go for the gold, I probably don't die. And I think for the sake of that, I can buy a boon at the next Caron shop. So while I would love to show you that, I'm gonna do my best to actually win this run or go as far as we can, see if we can explore any of the new regions. Cause that would be so cool. Ooh, that was a great terrain kill actually. This is gonna be a big hit. I'm not using my special a ton. I don't have anything on it. My attack is definitely the strongest thing. Something fun to note, these are not obols anymore. They are gold or coins and they're all imprinted with, um, what is his name? Kronos's icon, uh, like the time. Coins. So just a fun little detail. We should have enough money to buy a boon though. Oh, what is this? Okay, he was just far away. Once you get used to your button, not so bad. So like Hades 1, you still have your dash. It's called a sprint and you can hold it to get a longer effect. It's a really good way to like navigate the field. I will say in the first region, the maps have tended to be a little bit smaller, which I like. I think it works really Slowing well down. with um, Melanoi's play style because she, she has such control of the battlefield more so than Zag. Like you can hold enemies in one spot to do damage. Okay, grab the ashes here. So we could get more magic or we could get a palm. Our palm would only affect our attack. I'm thinking more magic could be helpful, especially since we don't have anything to create regen. Ow, jeez. Pretty big hit right there. I'm at about half health, which is one of the things always about roguelites is like health management is incredibly important. Oh. Nice big hit there. Should be able to get him here. Nice tonic. and easy. Not a whole lot of boons yet. There are a lot of god, like, uh, not gods, but spirits down here. Away. I'm so excited for more people to have access to this game though. Like, I enjoyed the technical test so much. And I think if you liked Hades 1, you will love this game. I will say though that like this is not the final polished version of the game. So if you're wanting that experience, it could be worth waiting till the full game is released. Because there are definitely a grind to any game like this. So it's important to like understand what you want from your experience and just play it how you want to. I, for one, cannot wait to play this. Hence why we're playing it the day it came out. It's fun though. Definitely want to get some more boons. I think not. We should be getting there soon though. Let's go Apollo again. We could get more magic, but I think this here is going to be more useful. I'm dying to see the other regions though that we haven't seen yet. Stop. Ah, I hurt. We'll see if I can make it past the first boss though. Not always the easiest thing. Ouch, ah, please get away. Please get away. Oh, I thought she was done yelling. She was not done yelling. I'm gonna go pick up this Molly. This is another meta progression item that you'll use in the cauldron. We'll see that a little bit later in this video, probably. Okay, your attacks might inflict days. So that's one that we didn't see before. Dazzling display, that's pretty cool. Supernova, your casts expand in size until they expire. That's pretty cool. And then you have your sprint basically has something. I think I'm gonna do dazzling display though, because I haven't seen I that one before. Olympus. And then we should have money to go to Carol. The music in this is so good. That breathing. Hi. 
I was really hoping they would have his art done for early access. They don't yet. Maybe in a later version, but that's okay. I'm in your debt, Lord Caron. These provisions surely shall make all the difference in my task. What gold I find is yours. She does understand Caron, is something interesting to note. And we only have Apollo here, so I say we just go with this Apollo. One, please. It's fortunate the underworld boatman's still plying his trade even during a downturn such as this. I trust his prices have gotten better at least. Or perhaps worse. Probably worse. Okay, critical miss. I haven't seen this one. Foes take damage whenever daze causes them to miss. That's really cool, actually. So lucid gained. Basically, your casts gradually restore your magic. Or Nova Flourish. I haven't been using my special a whole lot, but it makes your special deal more damage in a bigger area. I'm I'm sticking with my attack here. I think this is really interesting. And I'm going to grab the ashes just for meta progression. I have 20 HP. I'm going to do my best. Hey, I can see. There she is. You reached the edge of Erebus already. You have surpassed my expectations, Milenoe. It's like I've played the technical test. Thank you, Headmistress Hecate, for all your guidance and the compliment. In my place, you'd have done the same. However, now is not the time for pleasantries. It is for a demonstration of your capability. My capability? You'd have us face each other here, even though my task has already begun. Your training shall never be complete. And I would know if you stand any chance at all against our enemy. Wish me luck. <laughs> Crossed flames awaken. So she always does this attack to start. Oh shoot, that hit me hard. Nice and easy. Ah! Oh shoot, I'm gonna die. I have two HP. So in this phase, she has multiple, like, imposters, essentially. I'm gonna focus on just living here. She's over here. Please don't. Please don't with the. Please don't with the. I knew I was gonna lose. You're clearly unprepared as yet. You know what? I tried. I tried. <gasps> oh. Back already. And now we are in the crossroads, so much like the House of Hades, this is where we're going to be running around talking to people, interacting, and hugging our pet frog. See what I get for staying out all night, Frunos. It's really a mistake, Frunos. I will be talking with everyone, so as a warning, if you don't want spoilers, don't watch this part of the video. Um, typically how I'm going to format these videos is I will do one run at the beginning, and then I'll go around and talk to everyone, so if you just want to see the run, I'm trying to make it so it's easy for everyone to get what they want. And let's go look at this painting. This old unfinished painting. Don't look away. Don't forget all that the Titan took from you. Let's go talk to Dora. Who dares disturb my eternal rest? You trifle with powers far beyond your comprehension, witch. Speak! That was pretty decent, right, Mel? It may be pushing it. Okay, if I call you witch like that. Witch worked for me in context. And a solid haunting all in all, Dora. But I'd better run. Something I have to do. Then be gone. Then be gone. Stand tall and show no weakness. Let's look around. So this is still sealed. No idea what's behind that. The cauldron still locked up. Come here. Oh, hi. Time forced our hand, Melenoi. Nary a soul expected you to slay our enemy last night on a new moon, no less. But you accomplished something of great import. Thank you. I lack such forgiveness for my failure, had Mistress Hecate. The Titan yet lives, and Olympus yet burns, while I'm back where I started. What is it I accomplished? You're here to speak of it. Recovered in body, if not in spirit. You've not failed. Merely begun. Thus may you learn, grow stronger, and complete your task. Death to Kronos. Death to Kronos. Be well, Headmistress. And you, Melinda. Hail. 
Oh, hi. Tell me you killed the bastard. Drove your staff into his wretched skulls with a dagger in his gut. Uh, not that he'd die from that. Works on mortals, though. I've nothing to report, Odysseus. Not yet. Oops. Well, you'll get him next time, I reckon. Tough times. Already hit a wall. Knocked your scrawny ass all the way back here. It's insane that she's sending you out on foot, all on your own. Your skepticism's duly noted. I love her design. The crossroads. That haven hidden twixt the surface and the underworld conceals those still loyal to Lord Hades, rightful ruler of the dead. Together we'll retake my father's realm. That we will. That we will. Look at their little witch hat. Hail Shades. Our fight is just getting started. They're so cute. And our bestest boy is over here. <laughs> Look at his little eye mask. We'll find a way to wake you, oh sleep. I promise. He's so cute. And then our friend's over here. Hi, gang. Headmistress must have some important tasks for you. All right. And let's go on down here and see what we can unlock. My altar. So this is where, think of it like the Mirror of Darkness. This is our altar where we grow strong. Mistress lent me the Arcana. We have 30 ashes, so we're going to be using as many of these as we can. So the Sorceress, it, while you channel, so while you're doing any of your Omega moves, everything moves slower. If you've played Transistor, that's that element where it slows down the battle. It's very, very nice. The Wayward Sun, when you exit a location, restore two health. Or twice that, if you have no more than 30% of your health. We need sun. that. While you have less than 100% magic, your attack and special do more damage. That's pretty nice. Deal 20% damage to foes in your cast. Gain 20 health and 20 magic. I think we go with the Huntress here. The Huntress. <gasps> okay, it does scale. Oh, I'm so excited. I was wondering how that was going to work. Interesting. This would be really cool with um, anything from Artemis because it does critical damage if you're using Omega moves. Very cool. The Unseen, restore two every one second. I don't think death is worth it right now. Let's go. Let's get more health and the stuff. Titan. I think that will be really helpful. And then this is our death defiance. So I think that would be the next one we want to push. You'll notice over here that we have something called grasp. And each one of these cards in the top right of the card has a little hand icon. Each one takes a certain amount of grass. We have three left over right now. We would need to get more Psyche, so that blue uh, artwork down there. We've seen it a couple times on our run. Um, so we'll need to be focusing on getting that if we can. And then some more ashes. We probably won't be able to unlock that on That'll our next do. run, but that is very, very helpful. We don't have any new weapons unlocked yet. Disciples, attention! Allay your fears. She has returned. Nice, Calamus. The battle lost. But this is war, young one, and you have many battles yet to come. The only question is, are you prepared to win? I'm not so sure here, so let's see you give me 20. Commander Scalameus, sir. Yeah. Disciples, watch and learn. Take care of Scalameus. So you can see how the Omega attacks, and it slows time. It's kind of hard to see here. But it does slow time pretty significantly. There is still Dash Strike. I find the timing maybe a little bit harder right, to do. That's enough. But it's not too bad. I shall return. Goodbye, Skelemis. And yeah, so this is where you'll be getting your different items. There's Let's different see. things you can use to unlock different resources as you run through. And of course, there's an area where you can look off into the distance dramatically. Death to Kronos. I'll see to that. No one is more prepared. Beyond the mists of Erebus, there should be a way down. Too risky heading through Elysium. And too risky to stay. All right, it's time. It's beautiful, though. Super Giant's artwork will always be just breathtaking in my eyes. And yeah, there's one more thing I want to show before I wrap up this video. And there is a way to Ugh, go blasted up hordes. eventually. She's messing with that thing. Okay, Skillimaeus. But with that... I'm going to wrap up this video. Maybe next time we do a run we'll win and we'll see what happens. But thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you enjoyed the video in the comments below and what you're thinking of the early access. And I will see you next time as we 
delve deeper into the underworld. Ciao, friends!